Mike Dunleavy will fill a very powerful state legislative seat vacated after elections earlier this month. Political reporter Steve Kirch tells us it's a political party question lawmakers are now dealing with. Steve. Mike, Maria, to understand how the North Slope Borough's mayor's race is impacting the state House representatives, take a look at those results. Independent North Slope State Representative Josiah Pakatok won the North Slope Borough mayor's race with 55% of the vote. That means Pakatok had to resign. Now Governor Dunleavy has to name his replacement. But some lawmakers are asking if this, the legislature will still need to confirm the person Dunleavy eventually appoints. That's because Pakatok was not a member of a political party, even though he caucused with the House majority, who's mostly made up of Republican members. While state law says the governor can appoint any person they view as qualified without legislative confirmation, some House majority members want a legal opinion about the definition of party affiliation. Their concern, if a new appointee is also not affiliated with a political party, the new member might vote differently than majority members. What I will say is that we saw in the last session some difficulty to find consensus and direction for that majority, and that uh, that creates an opportunity for us to uh, weigh in and try to find uh, areas of agreement for the entire legislature to move forward on. We don't expect everyone to line up on every issue. So I don't see that causing division, as you say. I just think that's how people in each district represent their own district's issues, and we uh, incorporate them, and we accommodate them, and we try and move forward on general principles. Governor Dunleavy has 30 days to nominate someone to fill the seat. Applications are being accepted through October 31st. The governor's office has opened an online application form for interested candidates. Mike, Maria. All right, thanks, Steve.